It was a hard-fought result in Corvallis, but the Washington Huskies get it done in the rain. 22nd-ranked Washington beating Oregon State in double overtime 2-1. to one. The highlights of this one, the Huskies had the first early chance here. A bit of a controversial a controversial play here, Kelly. Yeah, you know, I'll call this the first goal. The question is, did that ball go out of bounds? And while my opinion doesn't really mean anything, I'm going to say it didn't. The referees thought that it did. But you see Mason Robertson keep it alive right there, and Kyle Coffey puts it away early in this game. That's okay. Mason Robertson would strike later on. More on that in a second or two. This is a fantastic chance for Don Chalau to put the Beavers on the board. Don Chalau, a good shoulder-to-shoulder -shoulder challenge with Steven Wright, and then touches right through Shielder's legs and calmly passes that ball into the back of the net for the 1-0 lead in the first half. That coming in the 30th minute, Chalau's third goal of the season. The sophomore from Candle, Arizona, so dangerous. Early second half, corner kick, penalty is called, and it sets up a penalty kick for Stephen Wright. Yeah, Garrett Jackson doing everything right, and Stephen Wright just tucking it in that bottom corner. Good pace, good accuracy. No question that that one was going away. One apiece in the 47th minute, Stephen Wright with two goals this season, both of them coming off penalty kicks. We go to double overtime, and it doesn't take very long for the Huskies to get it done. Elijah Rice starts it and Mason Robertson finishes it. Yeah, good confidence from Elijah Rice to take on Sam Tweeten. Takes that touch to the line right back to the top of the box, and Mason Robertson waiting on that penalty spot, just tucks it away with that left foot for the overtime victory. Robertson with his fourth goal of the year. He had the game winner here in Corvallis against the Beavers last year as well. Two to one, the final score in double overtime. Ryan Vincent in goal for the Oregon State Beavers starting in place of Nolan Worth who was injured. Did well, but overall not enough. Yeah, he did. He had a great game for his first game in the, at the collegiate level. Uh, but like you said, not quite enough to keep the score level. And the Beavers are still looking for their first win in Pac-12 play. Meanwhile, Washington goes to 9-4 on the season. The celebration here at Corvallis, but it belongs to the Huskies. They win the double overtime 2-1.